Who is that, Mike? Mike, what's up, baby? Hell yeah. <laughs> Look at Mike, he, this motherfucker still. Oh, it's time to let it go, man. You're getting too goddamn old to be swole like that, man. It's time to let it go. I'm doing everything reverse. I was smaller. God I'm damn, now. Mike, you still looking good, bro. <laughs> How the hell you doing, man? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm hanging in there. Yeah? You know. Florida treating you good? Oh, yeah. Right on. So. Yeah, you look great. Nice and lean, nice you. and fit. So do you, man. Trying. Jesus Christ. This men's fitness. <laughs> I know, man. <laughs> he go from Mr. Odom up to Men's Fitness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got a leg on him still, though. <laughs> All right. I ain't got shit there. A little bit. <laughs> I didn't, you put Chris I didn't, in the video? I didn't expect you to have that. How you doing? Chris, he trying to mic you up. Look. What up? <laughs> you motherfucker trying to mic you up now. He just going to throw you in there. <laughs> I ain't got no mic. No, no. No, 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 Oh, that's oh, you with all the little red ass. Ah! <laughs> with all the small ass teeth in your mouth. Hey, you were right there in front of the stage. Go like, ahead, man. Hey, you got to head him in the concert. Like, oh, yeah, that, that shit is sick. I was looking for, I was looking for those I girls. I brought you backstage, didn't I? I was looking for the girls. What were those girls? He went to the Conor Hammer concert, too. I What's those girls used to dance with him with that? Uh, I am. The, what's the, the girls? Yeah, man. Yeah. I am. Yeah. Hey, what's up, man? Right. How you doing, brother? What's up, brother? How you doing, bro? So, so, so what you want to start with, man? I don't know. What you want to start with? Just, uh, you know, you coming back here after four years, Dex, you know? Yeah. Same okay. as you, man. How long has it been? Chris ain't been here either. Nah, I don't come. I don't come at this way. Nah, I'm down to San Diego Chris now, man. Out. Chris bounced <laughs> out when they tried fucking with him. <laughs> oh, yeah. That guy ran out of here. <laughs> it was too stressful out here, man. <laughs> now, what's, what's it like coming back? Oh, well, you know. Shit. I know Chris, back in the day, Chris, Chris, all those guys used to work out here, man, and I, I, I just wanted to prove to everybody that I can make it and be successful pro out of Jacksonville because everybody thought they had to come out to the Mecca to become famous or, you know, or to be a good bodybuilder, you had to come here. So everybody's moving out here. So I wanted to prove to everybody that we can do it where you at. And you have to jump on, you know, jump on, but jump uh, up and come out here. But also, there was a lot of knowledge <laughs> out here that he yeah, wasn't, he wasn't getting really out there. That's what I saw, and I was always like watching him work out, and I was like, I like Dex. I said, I think you need to be out in Venice. It'll like, I think it'll prolong your career. I think. Oh, your idea. I mean, I, I put in his no. mind. He might have thought about it, oh. but I put it. I, you never got the call. <laughs> See, Dex did a lot of shows, so his mind don't work exactly. Like everybody else's. It never has. So his yeah. his carbohydrates been so low so long. So you don't know. Let me talk. Let me talk. Don't bring no carbs. Yeah, yeah, I don't man. Cut my carbs like that. See, so like, listen, listen, smaller, listen. Smaller, but we like did so many shows, dog. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah, no, but I but I did have a conversation. Like, hey, man, I think you should go out there and train out there in Venice, and you know, with Charles or whatever yeah, you do yeah. out here. Just be out here. But it's been different times in his career. Yeah. Yeah, we true. had some different conversations, like. And he don't remember this one. I was like, hey, I ain't doing yeah. Iron Man, man. Come out here and get that money, dog. Yeah. Come on and get that money. And I was sitting in the audience crying and shit because I was mad about it after I told him. I was like, man, I should be in this damn show. Well, you know, you that was 2000. I won the last four in a row. I was just like going like, hold oh, um. on. But, I, but if you, you know, as you get your career going, you're like, man, I should have got that show. I should have added that in my repertoire. Well, who won that my, show? No, you won. Okay, well, my and friend, I wanted you to won come. If, I, if you would have got in the show. Yeah, so you, <laughs> you wouldn't have came if I was in the show. What are you talking about? You got to make that trip to, to me. roll the dice with me, dog. You, you know I ain't no, I ain't no slouch. <laughs> he's, he's right. He's no, right. no. So, no, I just said. When Chris told me, he said, I ain't doing it, man. You ain't going to get it. I was come, like, come get that. I'll come get that. I'll come get that TG. That's it, G. But no, but I always been, hey, I always been, a big fan of Dex, man. He, I mean, I always saw what he brought to the table. Yep. You know, coming from uh, you know the the depths of what middleweight, yeah. on up to you yeah. know winning your pro card, and dealing. You know, it was never no okay. I need to be 212, and then I need to try to 
beat the smaller guys. He always went for the bigger guys and had, you know, a bigger prize in his mind. So, you know, came to the 99 Olympia, placing was it sixth or seventh? I can't remember. No, no, Olympia, I was ninth. Ninth. <clears throat> That's even, my first year. Even ninth. First year was ninth. So I was like, man, that was the cream of the crop right there. Yeah, so, man. So any any anyone's placing ahead at that point, he still didn't, he wasn't coming to his own yet, but yeah. I always knew he could and would. And, you know, even time he'd get, you know, frustrated because, you know, he's not a loser. You don't want to lose to nobody no matter what. Yeah. But when he was, you know, taking some losses and stuff, I still uh, yeah, see him coming. I'm like, man. So, you know, we still, we'll be in each other's rooms or heads or we, we, we traveling together, we, so we chopping up what you can do to get better. So I just knew it was only a time, uh, I mean, only a matter of time, you know. Yeah. But he had the longevity, didn't get hurt and stuff. So he did, he did it right, man. He was like, yeah. he walk away on his own terms. And so then when I right. finally, um, um, let's see, I, I think when I lost the Flex Pro to- um, Who was that? Evan Sintapani, when I lost to him, that's when I was, contemplating on retiring. I was pretty much, because I always said once some people saw beat me, they ain't got no business beat me, then I was going to retire. You know what I'm saying? Not, we not, all not, that. not to knock Evan. He's a great, great bodybuilder, but um, me at my best, I didn't feel that any, you know, no one should be beating me. That shouldn't be beating me is what I'm saying. The right? mentality so. was like this. If I, can, if, I can, if I can't qualify for the Olympia, I don't have no business out here. Right. You right. know what I'm saying? So that's, that's the mindset. I had, I know exactly probably had. Yeah, like, so you don't, yeah. You don't want to feel that. Yeah, because yeah. my first year, I'm in the top six. I'm in the, I'm in the polls now. My first year, my second year, okay. so it's like you know, you need to, anywhere past them double digits, man. You gotta go. <laughs> it's yeah. time to go. Yeah. Still in them double digits, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just saying, if you started down in the, in, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Get to that so point. yeah, yeah. So, so when that happened, that right there, I was contemplating on retiring, and. Um, that's when Charles stepped in, and Charles was like, "You know what, Dex? You need to come on out here. Come on out here to goals. Let me train you, and we'll do some different stuff, and we we'll do this and do that." I was like, "Yeah, okay. Let me think about it." And then George Ferris stepped to me around the same time. He was like, "Let me do you, you know, let me do your um, nutrition for you." And I was like, "What the fuck? What the hell?" So that's how that happened. That's how I started coming out the goals. Started training with Charles. Well, first I was coming out here. <clears throat> Two weeks at a time, just to give it, you know, get your um, feet wet with it. Yeah, get, yeah, yeah. <laughs> trying to give it a get little, acclimated. little test and see how how it works out. If I even like it or whatever. So I was coming out here for two weeks, then go back home for two weeks, flying all the way back here for two weeks, lugging all you know me. I had to, I had about five big ass bags, you know, because I like to, you know, stay fresh, dress, and have all you know two bags with shoes in it, you know. <laughs> so, so so I'm dragging all this shit back home every two weeks, and um, my, my girlfriend Gail was like, you know what? Why don't you just get a place out there? Get a place out there, that way you can leave the shit out there. When you come back, it's all gonna be there for you. I was like, yeah. So we, that's what I did. And um, hell, that shit lasted for 10 years. Right when everybody thought I was about to retire, Charles and George, we pushed that shit for another 10, 11 years, man. It was, it was, it was an amazing run. Shit, I remember I did some posing with my dog. He was yeah. mad at me in there. Yeah. He be getting mad at me when I push him. <laughs> <laughs> you get mad at everything. Damn, Chris. We did that shit one time. So, no, it was more than one time, dog. Oh, okay, two years. I was taking some pictures. This one, we you did had it one time. You won the title. When I, say, you title. when I say one time, I mean one oh, year. Oh, one period. Yeah, yeah. One year. We yeah, did yeah, one period. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the shows it's for that one year. Yeah, like but, one time. hey. That's why I like learning on me. So, so that's what I'm telling Like, people act like, like, oh, Chris is all about a good time. So, man, I'm a dog in the gym, dog. I don't, I'm, boy, people that know, that know that been around me, they, they have a different perspective than a lot of people that don't. But people act like, I ain't that dude. Like, Dexter, no, I'm that dude. That's the, that's the, you know, I'm about that yeah, work, dog. Yeah. I'm you about that. Every, every time I see you in you train Every, every interview you see me do. Hard, I'm about that work, dog. Hard. Every interview you see me do, I, I always mention, Chris yes, as have. being the one that taught me that I've learned so much about. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You know, sure. he taught me Chris, for Chris sure, dog. So much. For yeah. sure, man. I'm, I'm, I'm about that work, man. But I, but I knew I was putting my energy in the right way, in the right direction. So yeah. it was all good, man. I I uh, and I was there when he won that won the Olympia, dog. That that felt like, man, like I won that damn thing too. You know, yeah. just because just because that was like my boy, man. I was like my little my little dude, man. It's like. I saw it coming from years ago, you know, when other people maybe have not thought that of him, I was thinking that, so 
I was just happy to see him do it, man. That's crazy, man. To come up from the middleweight? Oh, I came up from a bantamweight. Bantamweight. Bantam. Bantamweight yeah. all but the way But you turned pro at middleweight, or did I you? turned pro at light heavy. Light heavy, okay, okay. My bad. I was, I was 180. My bad, man. 187. 187? Yep. That's tight. Yeah, man, so. So what do you guys think about the new gym, man? Since, uh, since you guys left, you haven't been back here in four years. Oh, man. Well, well to me, here's the thing, it's, it's yeah. different for me. I was coming here as a teenager. Yeah. So I was coming here as a teenager. You know, I'm 15, so 16, I'm walking. I'm, I trained for the Teenage California here. I trained for the Mr. USA here. And uh, it was Mr. You know, Mr. Cal, all that stuff I wanted coming out of here. So it's just a different thing for me because I used to walk in with like a whole different vibe of energy when you walk in. Energy. Yeah. You can, you almost, you can almost hear a buzz in your ear when you walk in this thing. Right? And people, yeah, you got like you got like 10 of the top 15 guys in the world training here at one yeah. time. Yeah. So that's a different perspective for me. But then let's go through the pandemic and stuff. I and mean, you still they still try to keep it going some kind of way and research that a, a different look here. Um, you know, I, I started to train people here, so it was a whole nother realm of feelings and issues and situations for me to be here. I feel that too. That's a little different. So, yeah, so I just as a business, trying to work a business out here, that was a little bit different for me. That was, people were happy for me at first, and then they was kind of mad at me. I don't know what it was, but I got, I got, I just had to leave here, man. I, and I'm down in San Diego now. I'm happy uh, doing what I'm doing, and I'm giving back to the, uh, the community of uh, bodybuilding and, uh, you know, in all kinds of different ways, you know, doing more talking now. I didn't used to talk that much back in the day. No, you didn't. No, I didn't. No. But yeah, I'm, doing scared. That. I'm doing that now. I'm scared. Nervous. <laughs> now, shy. I'm shy. No, she is. <laughs> <laughs> My boy. <laughs> yeah, I'm shy, <laughs> dog. <laughs> I'm seriously <laughs> shy. <laughs> what about you? <laughs> What's that? Well, how do you feel about the new good um, well, I wasn't back in Chris days. I can just imagine how crazy it was back then. Yeah. But I know nice. I got out here in 2010. We kind of brought that vibe back a little bit because we had Sean and we had Sergio. We had a lot of top guys out here at the time as well. But nothing like that. But we brought it back. Yeah. And now when we left, it's like, okay, I don't know nobody up in here. You know what I'm saying? So I'd be, I'd be happy to I'd be happy to get in without having to pay. <laughs> that's, that's where we at now. <laughs> but you know what though? Even though even though it's changed so much and it got the gym outside, I, I kind of like it like this. To be honest with you, I just the atmosphere is just not the same. Yeah. See, I don't train like we used to train anyway. Yeah. This atmosphere is what I'm pretty much like when I'm back home now anyway because of the style of training I do. You know, so you know, like I told you know, like I told you when I got here. I don't train no more. I exercise. Yeah, you I feel have, me? I so, have a lot of footage also from uh, from back in the '90s that I haven't, no one's ever seen because I had my own camera back then. Really? Yeah. I want well, to, to take I want, it. I want, time to bring, I want it, bring out. it out. Yeah, it's time to bring it out. You got me on there. I've got to put it. Now you weren't here yet. Oh. But I have Kobe on video. I have uh, he Do was here training. Yeah. Really? I got Kobe. I got people. We in New York and sometime my camera had. Like training with Robbie Robinson and. We're pushing some heavy weight up in here. I got all that on video. Oh, and I put it on I disc already. Because you the big boy, that no. shit on social media. Because I just, no, I had it on tape. <laughs> and He's then I had it on. There go your bird. best friend right there. Oh, yeah. uh, shit. I had it on tape. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> that boy looking like. <laughs> <laughs> what up, dog? Too much, man. What's going on? Yeah, living life, living brain, baby. That's what's up, man. I'm, I'm with you, bro. I'm not in the dream, little shit. Living the dream, bro. I ain't no one recognizing with all that beard. That's that, what I wanted. That's why I wanted that, bro. I don't want to be recognized. Yeah. Dude, I'm on the wall. He's gone. I'm done with that one. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but yeah. Boys got all deep. <laughs> yeah, dude. <boy. laughs> <laughs> Jerome, people, Jerome. Jerome. Oh, wow. oh, I was saying Jerome. Oh. <laughs> Oh snap, hey, they're wrong. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. He's all right, right, right. right, right. What, what are you guys doing, man? Trying to do a little interview, man. Oh, okay. You're just crashing it out. I see you. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. Oh, shit. Just a little bit. When you, when you I'm, leave, going, I'm, I'm leaving out here later on today. Uh, yeah, we got some stuff Where to do this going? weekend. I'm going Riverside with you, man. We bunking up. We got yeah, she is. <laughs> we bunking hey, up. Hey Chris, so you going out there today? No. Nah, I've been out there. I've, I've been nah, out there. Nah. Oh, you been out there already? No, I'm, I'm going, going back, back to San there. Diego. I'm gonna drive out there Saturday morning. You driving all the way back to San Diego and then back at the Riverside? 
Yes. Ah, damn. I don't move around like that that much, but it's, it's a new, it's a, it's a, I got a guy in the show, so I got to go see him there for sure. Gotcha. And so then, why uh, you came today, all the way in? I come to see people like you and, okay, and okay. Rico and, you all know, right. we trying, I just want to highlight my boys, man. Y'all come okay. into town. I'm trying to make it, trying to make an appearance. That's you know? what's up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, dog. You make me feel I was good, coming. Man, I said, you said he's coming. Man. I said, I said, oh, Dex is at the Gold's Gym. Look. <laughs> He right there. I saw you on the phone. <laughs> it's my boy. Hey, man. I, I, I mean, I'm sitting here looking at the thing to see you guys on stage. You know, how long you been in? Yeah, oh, dude. You know, been in since you've been in, huh? I've been in, well, I, I really got things probably in, um, I really came on like 94, though. Yeah, I bought my house back here in 98, so. God damn. Yeah. I'm a little fat, buddy. Been in for a minute. Man. Chris, you was in the 80s? Yeah, I was in the 80s. Oh, the 70s? 80s, dog. Oh, okay. <laughs> 80s, dog. I mean, I, I, hey, look, 80s. you know what? You know what? Being a bodybuilder, you do it right, though, your agents, bro. Don't nothing change. Let you allow you change, man. That's, that's all I say, bro. Age is number to number, bro. It just said, how many times the Earth circle of the sun hadn't done do it? Hell yeah. Right here. Good to see you, my man. Let's oh, get yeah, let me get up in here. Let me get up in here, my boy. Man. Come on, get in here, dog. Get on in here. Damn it. Come on, get on in here. I don't know we're going to see another one of these, baby. Right. That boy, that crazy. <laughs> 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 hey, look at that. Oh, you're hating. I ain't mad at him, though. Hey, look. 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 What big wheel at, man? I ain't seen him. I ain't seen Will, Will. I ain't seen 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 Will. I ain't seen